see. It's kind of funny that we're in this building, the Huntsman, you know, Huntsman Library. Because you talk about leaving a legacy. I grew up with the Huntsman kids in Sugar House. Went to high school with a couple of their kids. And, you know, it was, everybody knows they're successful. They've got the Huntsman Cancer Institute, the huge business, the billions of dollars. Everybody knows about all these things. What you don't know is that you don't see it. You never saw it with James when I was growing up with him. He had a car. It wasn't a fancy car. But his mom and dad, they leave quite the wake. With everything that they donate, their philanthropy, the philanthropy that they're doing, um, the time that they spend with individuals like me when I was growing up, they leave quite the wake. It's kind of why I'm here today. You love paying it forward. If it's truly something you love, you want to pay it forward. You want to make sure people have the opportunity to learn from your experiences, both good and bad, as well as the way, you, or the way you've learned coming up through the, in, into this entrepreneurial world from others. And I hope that, for me personally, I hope that my legacy is that he did what he said he did, you could count on him. He was a great friend. He was a better husband and a better father. And I think for me, if I can dial those in and at the end of my life, which unfortunately most of us don't find out about until we're, sitting, we're dead in that coffin and they're talking about it at our, at our funeral. But it's the way it should be. You want to leave the wake without the recognition. You want to be more and appear less. 